Okay, apparently, so this is where I actually stopped the video uh, in the previous video, and this is going to be going with a post narration since I probably lost the audio file for this one, so I probably have to you know redo it by adding all the by speeding it up, and the thought of it re of redoing this video is already so bad. So I, I I have absolutely no intention of redoing this video. And, um, yeah, th th I have deleted the audio file very stupidly, and I'm also not going to edit out any other wild battles, because it just requires effort and stuff, and I have to sit here like 14 minutes just editing, just editing out all the wild battles, and which is clearly stupid, and uh, for some reason, my preview half is keep, my good full preview half is just keeping, uh, keep changing on my, at the top of my Vegas, which is very very annoying and this is apparently the first time you actually seen Paris nothing else new here okay so um, uh, this is a last trainer and she, she just said that this place is freaking big apparently and yeah this, this place is big after all cuz this is Mount Moon and it's supposed to be a cave and a big one too seriously man like why are so many people inside a cave Remind me why am I in the cave? I mean, why do why do the people make it like this is the only way that you're supposed to get to Cerulean City? I suppose there are other ways, but damn it, uh, this is stupid. So yeah, Bellsboro, no, not too much fancy, but it keeps using Quick Attack, uh, not nah, Wine Whip like crazy, and I use Quick Attack like crazy. So Wine Whip does a fair number of damage, despite Pidgey has great defenses. But ack, but nothing too fancy apparently. So, I come on, uh, my preview full and good full. Just make up your mind. Just stay in one order. Oh my god, that's that's probably what happens every time when I try to edit when the clip keeps changing. It doesn't keep staying in one consistent order. Order, yeah. Apparently, I'm not. I'm this. This video clearly proves that I'm really bad at tongue twisters, and there is actually TMO one. So I I I apparently like spend 95 million years to figure out which Pokemon that I have to teach it. Apparently I was about to teach it to Aquatoys, but then I probably realized that you know, Yuki doesn't really have doesn't really have any good moves other than Thunder Shock. So I decided to give it to Yuki instead instead of Aquatoys. Besides, Aquatoys would be learning a lot better moves later on. For now, it it and besides, it's already good enough right now. We are pulling up a big job here. <laughs> I always really find like what job they were a actually pulling out. Apparently, they were just trying to collect fossils and just try to sell them. Apparently, there are only like there are only two of them. Why 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 couldn't they do that? Like why couldn't they? <laughs> like what what what? I don't know. Like they're just wasting time here. They're they're not. They're just standing in one pose and they're not moving around. They're not working. They're just waiting for trainers to pass by, pass by, and then annoy them. Okay, apparently, and Ekans. Um, yeah, this thing is kind of a jerk, and it it never dies. It just keeps spamming rap at me. Well, this. Oh, okay, never mind. This is not the Ekans that I was talking about, but there is one more Ekans out there. It's just Oh my god, I don't I wouldn't even speak of the speak of that. God, why can't I talk? And I'm actually recording this in next day morning. And guess what? In the next video, I actually recorded that yesterday and I actually finished I I recorded that yesterday and with my audio not being scrapped. So, apparently I just should never shall not never do that again. Make that mistake what I'm talking about. You all know I can't talk, so it's not such a big deal. And here I probably decided to switch in. Yeah, I'm gonna decide to keep Falcon in because Falcon is probably gonna evolve at level 18. So yeah, that's probably I, I can't wait for that. Apparently, why do I why do I keep using the word apparently all the time, even though I probably don't need to? Cause I'm stupid, and you all know that, and my grammar sucks dick. Okay, come on. Yeah, now I, I, there I thought I was about to die, but then again, when I try to use potion, only then that thing decides to use tackle. And it's kind of embarrassing of the fact that Pidgey is actually slower in that Rattata. 
that is not supposed to be happening at all. So, yeah, we go on and take on another Rattata. This guy apparently has two Rattatas and one Zubat. It's stupid. Why, why, why would you ever have, have that? So, I think here I kind of failed to switch here. So, I was about to go to Pikachu, but then I I wasn't paying attention on what I'm doing, so I probably keeps uh, end up staying with Pidgey. So, but Pidgey gets all the experience, though, but that experience of with... Um, Pikachu would be really nice. Uh, come on, preview full, stop changing now. Um, so yeah, this guy actually has two Geodudes and one Onyx. Before I do anything else, I probably want to go and get that Moonstone, apparently. And on the way, I probably run into a million Zubats. So, but fun. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so... Like, this guy actually, like... Wh how could I ever shock him? Apparently, I'm not a ghost or something. There are people in this cave, you know. And a lot of rocket grunts, not to mention. Yep, I will go with bubble, because water gun on this thing is pretty useless, because I could probably kill this with one bubble. And since this thing is now a war turtle, and its back, back spread is kind of cool, I guess. And Blastoise would be even more awesome, but I can't get that un until for quite a while, so I'll be using water turtle until then. And he's going to about Onyx. This is also a very easy thing, and we actually saw this in Brock's gym. And now, it's just sitting here with a hiker at level 10. It's not too tough, actually, compared to that. So, this guy actually has two Geodudes and one Onyx. Fun. And I, I always thought Onyx was really cool, but they're really worthless. Despite its being a giant rock snake and has one of the Pokemon with very high defenses, it is still a jerk. It is still bad. And apparently I tried to find some revives here, but I found no luck. So, I decided to move on in this guy. And I dis so I I probably kept, kept in War Turtle and actually decided to heal up everyone else. So, this, this guy actually has a very tough Pokemon, apparently. And, let's see what he has. And, little kid should leave. <laughs> okay, never mind. I kind of didn't read that. And he actually has a severely overpowered Eradicate. This thing is an has it, it, it's an illegal evolution. He's not supposed to get Eradicate until level 20, but apparently he did. And this thing completely screws me over. Actually, not really. I, that's what I thought, but no. I, apparently, War Turtle did an excellent job at this. I don't know. Hyper Fang and being a very powerful move at this point of the game still didn't do a whole lot. And... Quick Attack got a critical hit, uh, no, it didn't get a critical hit, and now the Hyper Fang is probably going to get a critical hit, apparently, but it still will take that, uh, it will take a fair amount of good damage, so, War Turtle grew to level 18, and that's awesome. I was really dreading to fight this guy, I, I was really not looking forward to this, because that Raticate, uh, my past experiences, that thing just killed me every single time, so... You you can't ex you can't expect me not to be worried. So yeah, on the way we'll be running into millions Zubats and Geodudes. Fun. <sighs> no kidding. And yeah, I'm so stupid. Like, why did I ever delete this audio file of this video? And this video apparently happens to be 14 minutes long or even longer. So I decided to speed it up, and I just apparently no. Why did I keep saying apparently all the time? I just throw that word around a lot. I shouldn't. I should stop saying that. Yeah. Uh, the thing is, uh, this was supposed to be 14 minutes long, but I sped it up to 10 minutes because I won't. I I really don't have to edit out all the every single stuff. And on the top of that, editing without my audio file is kind of a pain because my audio file actually shows which part that I probably need to edit. And uh, th th and cause I I won't pr I usually don't talk over while I uh, talk over any while I'm actually going after Pokemon Center where I pro where I pro exactly know where I'm gonna edit. Never mind. I kind of don't know how to explain that. Maybe uh, sometime like in a million years I'll probably explain that. And there's a hidden Moonstone. Yay for that. I don't think I'll be using those things cause I don't think I'll be getting any Pokemon that will probably need the Moonstone. So, the Moonstone, yeah, my grammar all is already wonderful. And, hey, stop. And this guy is gonna have, it's, it's not gonna give us his fossil, so apparently we have to beat him up to just get it, to get one of those fossils, apparently. 
So, yeah, Grimer... Grimer is nothing but a big... It, I don't know what else to say here. Grimer's pride is just ridiculous. Just look at that. It just looks like a frozen simon with eyes and mouth. With, uh, with the eyes and mouth. It doesn't look like a Grimer at all. Uh, when I saw when when I saw the anime, like is that supposed to be Grimer? And apparently it is. And it looks nothing like one. But in Yellow, they made it kind of a little original, since Grimer actually kind of looks like a Grimer in that. So, okay. Apparently, I stopped the video right here. So, thank you for watching.